of my darling divas welcome back to another day here on no minus plus if you were around yesterday then you know that i did my monthly dn call unboxing so you guys already know what today's video is going to be about it is going to be me styling and trying on the pieces from this month's box now if you missed the unboxing do not worry girl i got you because i'm going to link down below if you're on the blog it'll be clicked somewhere there for you to see and you can check out yesterday's video which was me showing you guys all these pieces now we're gonna get into what we're here for the styling and the try on I'm gonna go through these pieces I'm gonna tell you guys what I'm keeping what I'm sending back and how I would style them and then of course you guys can see a clip of me trying it on what's different this time around this month is that I requested my stylist I was styled by Luna hey girl hey um, so if you ever want to request the stylist, I do tell you how to do so in yesterday's video. So just pause me and check it out if you didn't already. I'm going to give you a couple seconds. Okay, unpause, you back. Alright, now let's get back into business. <laughs> so we have a lot to talk about, so let's just hop right in. Now, I just have all of my clothes from the unboxing here on my handy dandy fashion rack. It is in no particular order at all, so I'm just going to grab or it's going to move along. So, the first piece up is the Lise Jennifer Seamed Pant. It's in the color black, obviously. It comes in a size 2X and it's $98. Now, actually, when I read the label, this is a 3X and not a 2X, but I'm glad that it is a 3X because this fit perfectly, nice and snug. So, I imagine if I had a 2X, it wouldn't fit that great. Now, with a basic pair of black crop pants, anything is possible. Pretty much pair it with a crop top, you can pair it with a peplum, you can pair it with pretty much anything. It's a basic signature that you need in your wardrobe. I surprisingly enough do not have any black pants, period, or any black pants like this. So I'm actually going to keep this because this is a steel that you just have to have. The material is very forgiving, very smoothing, and I just have to keep this piece. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that as far as shoes, I think that this would be really sexy with some lace-up heels. Um, you can definitely go with flat heels. I mean, the possibilities are pretty much endless when it comes to these pants. You can always check out the styling collages, which I include in each blog post for these videos, to see exactly how I would style each piece if you're interested. But this is definitely a keeper, so there's no way that I'm giving this up. So here is how the Lise Jennifer Seam pant looks like try on. Here is the Moto Mix Shayna Fit and Flare dress in the color multi. It comes in a 16 wide. And I am really starting to love Moto Mix as a brand. Every time that I get a Moto Mix item in my Dia and Co box, it always fits really great. So I'm very appreciative that um, I'm able to, to know about Moto Mix through these um, boxes because I never knew about the brand before. I am very tall, I am 5'11", so when you get a skater skirt that covers your butt, you keep it. So I'm going to be keeping this. Also, it, it is, it's in a 16 wide and I do have a wider back, so I was definitely like happy to know that my back was covered. Basically, this dress had my back, pun intended. So basically, when it comes to styling this dress, I would pick um, a color from it, so maybe an orange or a yellow or maybe a pink. And I would basically pair it with solid. So I would pair it with a clutch and heels that are a solid color. Um, I definitely believe in mixing colors. So I would probably do a yellow pump and a pink clutch. Or maybe if I'm feeling really, you know, matchy matchy, I'll just do yellow heels and a yellow purse. But basically, I want the dress to be the statement piece of this outfit. So I would only pair it with solid colors. Um, because it's a very busy print so basically just a color adding a color with your accessories and your shoes will definitely um, go hand in hand with a such a bold print like this one so here is what the Shayna Fit Flare dress looks like try to journey blouse in the color black it's in a 1x and it's 3290 now for those of you who may or may not know I pretty much wore all black for a year 
because at my old job I was required to wear all black so I'm kind of sort of tired of wearing black like oh my god no more black clothing this top was a bit snug on me due to me having a fuller tummy and my bust being a bit bigger I know that I can size up but I'm definitely gonna send this shirt back just because I don't need it it's a very beautiful simple basic top but I have plenty of tops like this already in my wardrobe so I'm just gonna send this one back and let another lucky Bia and co lady snag this one on up as far as styling I would definitely style it with the black pant because I feel like it would give a very like smooth monochromatic type look and I love pairing you know I've been loving the mono look the monochromatic look not the mono look no the monochromatic look of pairing similar colors together and having like all one color outfit I've been loving 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 doing that so I would definitely pair this with um, black bottoms you can also pair with a high-waisted skirt bring it all the way to the top you can pair it with jeans this one is a very casual basic that can pretty much be um, paired any old way you can never go wrong with the black top honestly so here is how the fashion to figure journey blouse looks like try to to figure um, edition. This is the Jade Chambray Tunic in gray. It's a 1X. It's $34.90. Now, I am going to send this back due to the fact that it is um, a little tight in my bust area once again. Um, I am aware that you can wear this open, but it's also just not my style. You know what I'm saying? Um, the chambray is not really something that I really like all the time. It is a very beautiful top, and I do believe that it is can do wonders in my wardrobe, but I'm just not feeling it, and I want to be able to button it up as well as, um, as, well as wear it open. I want to be able to wear it as many ways as I can. I do like the high-low feature in the back. But I'm definitely going to send this one back. Um, but it, it was a good pick. Um, but just not for me. So here's how the Jade Chambray top looks like. Try it on. Lindsay top in yellow. It's a 1X. It's $49 to keep. I am definitely, definitely keeping this top because why wouldn't I? It fits like a dream. This color is amazing and who doesn't love a good peplum? It covers your tummy when you want it to. It has a nice little detailing in the back. It covers that top part of your butt. Like why wouldn't you keep this? I can see myself rocking this in the cold weather because it is like a neoprene type of fit so it's very thick. Um, so do I rock yellow when everybody else is rocking dark colors? Yes, I do. You wear whatever you want whenever you pop it, right? So I definitely can see myself making this a staple in my fall and winter wardrobe. So I cannot wait to have fun with this top then. So I'm going to be definitely keeping it. As far as styling it, I will style it once again with these pants. I think that this is such a wonderful color combination. Sure, I'm going to look like a bumblebee, but that's fine. I do not care because... I actually tried this one together and it is an amazing combo. Um, I would also fit a skirt underneath to kind of give it like a peplum kind of top and make it look like it's a, like all one dress. Like a, maybe a black um, bottom or maybe like a white and black striped skirt would go really well with this. Pairing it with some jeans and some cute flats to kind of give me a dressy casual type of outfit. Um, when it gets colder outside, I'm going to throw a blazer and a cardigan over it. And pretty much this top is going to give me so much life. I cannot wait to wear this. So here is how the Motomix Lindsay top looks like. Try it on. get a Dia and Co box of your own. I promise you it's like Christmas every month and it's definitely 
worth it. If you want to grab a box of your own, you can click the link down below and it will take you to the website where you can sign up, fill out your profile, and get your first box. It's $20 a month and I do have a more in-depth informational video about Dia and calling the company and how it works and all that good stuff. I will link that down below for you to check out as a reference. Be sure to come back here next week for two brand spanking new blog posts. I promise you they're going to be popping because they always are, right? And for all of my new subscribers and any new Dawn and Divas, hey, what's up? Welcome to the No Minus Plus family. I have been getting a little bit of new people every day and that's really amazing. So definitely spread the word and um, if, you, if you keep stopping by and haven't subscribed yet, girl, what you waiting for? Click that subscribe button. You know you like me. You know you want to chill. You, wanna, you know you want to be a part of the fam. Just come on. We, we don't fight. I don't fight. Let's do it. <laughs> but I'm going to go. I'm in such a crazy, fun mood and I'm going to enjoy, enjoy the rest of my day. Um, but yes, click that link down below. For more information on everything that you've seen in today's video, including more pics and all of the styling collages for each of these pieces, be sure to follow my blog and go to the blog at www.nothingmindaboutplus.blogspot.com. There you will find everything you need to know. Also, are we connected on social media yet? Are we friends on there? We should be. If you want to follow me, I will leave all my links down below and you really should. You should especially follow me on Snapchat because I'll be up there acting a hot mess and we can definitely have fun together. So I'm going to go. I love you like the tarot and I will see you ladies next week.